Hi y'all. Welcome back to Gentle Charm Budgets or welcome to the first timers. I'm the Charming Heather Gentle and this is where we talk about all things budgeting, cash stuffing, bullet journaling, and life planning. If that's something you're interested in, go ahead, take a minute, hit the like and subscribe button, and leave me a comment below because you know I love hearing from you guys. No more time. Can we make a move? Overthinking. You and I. What do we have to lose? All right, so we're back with our paycheck budget for the 19th of August. Let's see. We need to cover everything from the 19th to the 25th. But um, I had a really great check this week. Brian's check had a little bit of extra on it. So we're going to knock out the rest of these bills for the month, except for Netflix, and that's just because it comes out on automatic pay. So let's get started, because I keep working this budget over, and it keeps ending up weird. I don't know. But hopefully it'll work out right. That's the plan for now, anyway. Okay. So, we'll start with our rollover. Make sure you guys can see that okay. We have Brian and myself. We're going to go with zero rollover for now. Brian is going to make 829.86. And mine's $2,292.61. So $8.29.86, $2,292.61. Equals three thousand one hundred twenty two dollars and forty seven cents. So <laughs> let's see. We're going to have way too much stuff, so I'm probably going to run down into this and maybe even use this over here some, but we'll we'll see how far we can go. So we'll start with the indigo card. Forty dollars and the destiny forty nine dollars. The mission lane card is twenty five dollars. Home Depot it's twenty nine dollars. Credit one is thirty-four dollars. Another credit one will be forty-seven dollars. And one more will be fifty dollars. I'm putting two hundred dollars on our Amazon card and our Sam's card is going to get twenty nine dollars um, football season's coming back so I had to get the Hulu for my husband I um, I purchased Hulu from well it's football season so um, the last one all I'll shut it off again in January and it'll go through Super Bowl. <laughs> so it was $69.99. And okay, let's total this one. 40. 
29, 25, 29, 34, 47, 50, 229, and 69.99 equals 572.99. Subtract that from 312247. Left over gives us two five four nine forty eight. Okay. Next, we're going to do our shell card for gas. I'm going to put three hundred on it. Cell phones um, is two eighty five. Because last month I um, made the payment and then I think like the next day the um, automated payment come out. So that meant it was already going through. And so it basically got a double um, piece of payment because I had split the payment up last month. Um, car insurance. Is four twenty six twenty five the power bill or utilities is five oh nine ninety four. Okay, our total on this part of it is Fifteen twenty one is that right? Twenty one nineteen. Fifteen twenty one nineteen. So left over the one thousand twenty eight dollars and twenty nine cents. Now we have groceries. Two hundred dollars. Dining out. Seventy five dollars. Spending is getting twenty. And miscellaneous is getting ten. All right, total on this is three oh five. Equal leftover would be seven twenty three. And that will go into savings and maybe extra, I may pay your credit card off if we, so I'm just going to make a note down here, savings and then pay small debt with that 723. Let's see. 
If I'm right on the small debt, it will be 260. Um, so that will leave 463 for savings our savings challenges, and that will give us a zero base budget. Seven twenty-three, which means leftover will be zero. There you go. That worked out perfectly. Um, okay. I hope y'all seen that whole thing. I'm going to move this over. And we're going to stuff our wallet. So I went ahead and um, pulled the change out because I, uh, my niece sold me her change. Um, so we'll be stuffing a lot of change this time. So I went ahead and put it all in this one little thing, this little zip pouch thingy. But let's do this. Okay. Oh, let's count. One, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 50, 60, 75, 80. So 80 is what we're stuffing. We didn't have any money left over. So groceries is getting $200. So 120, 40, 60, 80, 90, 120, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 75. Spending is getting 20. And this is what we use for purchasing household products such as toilet paper and shampoos. And then miscellaneous is getting 10. I put these two quarters in there so that I'd have some for the meter and Aldi. So I'm trying to keep a couple quarters on me. Um, miscellaneous is getting 10. And then this, my husband got a reward bonus and he split it with me. He got $150 for his reward bonus. I call it extra money for doing his job, but they consider it going above and beyond his job and they rewarded him by giving him extra cash. So, um, He split it with me, but he said I couldn't put it in savings challenges because he asked me what I would do with it, and I told him I'd probably put it in savings challenges, and he told me I couldn't do that. He said I actually had to spend it on myself, and he took 75 and he gave me 75 So this is the $75, so 20 40 60 75 and I'm just going to put that here. Um, and I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Might go to Hobby Lobby or somewhere. I don't know. But I'm going to spend it as he requested. So, 
that's it for tonight, guys. Don't forget to go check out the BCL ladies. Y'all have a great night. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe and comment and all the things if you liked my videos. Have a good night. Bye. Can we make a move? Overthinking you and I.